This is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here on this Tuesday, the 4th of April, and we're looking at the Dow. Up a little bit, up two points at 30,602. But this is going to be interesting because it's right at what was a strong resistance area um, and also a support area. This is that trend line that went that midpoint of the rectangle. I don't want to make it too messy, but you see this gray line? We're right there. Wait a minute. Look at the S&P. Remember, I, I spoke about this pattern. Now we had a core and I spoke about it spoke about the falling axe formation, how if you start to uh, make, uh, I'll do this in my show in more detail, but if you start to make lower lows and much, much lower highs and much lower lows, then at a certain point you might turn around with a V-shaped pattern. If you break that trend line, you can do a one-to-one -to, -one to the upside. I'm very conservative. I take it with a one-to-one, -one, but I start from a trough below, and now we've gone from 4,100 where the target was. We were at 4,132. Uh, maybe by the end of the day, I can raise it a little bit to go into the 41.58 area. We're looking at the QQQ, which finally is showing some strength. It's up 0.42 percent, Dow's up 0.07 percent, and the S&P is up 0.20 percent. So this is really very nice action. It started its leg deep. That's what we were looking for uh, in the Chapman Wave methodology. A buy signal going to a buy mode takes you to at least four higher peaks. Peak D, the Dow's only in leg C. So this is going to be very interesting. We're looking at the IWM. IWM right now is trading down, being very weak, down 92 cents at 172.56. Gold holds very well. Gold is up 15, uh, 2015. It's within this rectangle, holding very nicely. Dollars going down. Uh, dollars pulled back. It's, oh, it's unchanged right now. It's at 102.04. I think gold uh, is uh, silver is getting rid. Let me just do this quickly. Silver has been extending its gains while go gold has gone sideways. And that's kind of what we always see in the rotation. We're looking at uh, the bonds, U.S. bonds. This is bonds right now, up 6.30 seconds. So yields are coming down a little bit. Crude oil still holds very well after the big move up yesterday. In fact, it made us in the continuous contract. It's up uh, 89 cents at 81.31. I'll talk about all of these when I get back for the Tiger Indonesians Hour. I think the market's starting to get a little choppy. We'll talk about that. Be fabulous this, thus far. See you in a moment for the Tiger Technicians Hour. Check out my opening for daily newsletter.